everyone what's going on it's Sam here from the channel handsome smiles thank you for joining me in another review today I'm going to be doing a review from the house of Alexa out there and this one is called Irish Sheepra so Irish Sheepra let's run through the notes and then I'll talk you through uh, what this smells like and give you an idea of its performance suitability of occasion and my final overall rating so Irish Sheepra from Alexa out there at the top we're going to get bergamot cinnamon clove and ginger the heart of the fragrance is rose de may jasmine and ylang ylang and the base of the fragrance is labdanum starak oak moss patchouli cedarwood tonka bean oris oris absolute ambergris vanilla and benzoin it's quite an extensive note list especially in the base of the fragrance but what do we get on our skin when i first apply this uh, uh this other onto my skin irish shepra i get this uh, immediate smell of vintage old school aftershave um, with a slight medicinal feel and I get a very gentle barbershop, old school barbershop feel as well the the main notes that I pick up in the opening are the clove, the ginger and I also pick up uh, the bit of the cinnamon as well especially that, that cinnamon gives it like an orangey sort of feel and when I mentioned the after old school aftershave Feel that I get it's the liquid that you apply on your face after you've cut yourself the aftershave liquid old school I remember my granddad used to have a bottle of this uh, orange liquid it was this old school aftershave uh, liquid that you would apply onto your face after you've had a shave and it will close up any cuts or marks that you get in your face after shaving and the smell of that is what I get in the opening it has slightly medicinal feel but there's this uh, warm spiciness as well from that cinnamon the clove and the ginger as the scent develops uh, it becomes a little bit more smoother and sweeter as well and I believe the sweet aspect that I pick up as the fragrance develops it's coming from possibly help from that benzoin and the vanilla and also into the heart it's where this uh, beautiful jasmine starts to glow in the composition it's very floral sweet very rich uh, and has a very bright quality as well and starts giving this scent more of a floral sort of feel and as the fragrance dries down this is where the Irish the Irish notes takes the center stage it adds this beautiful floral powderiness to the composition with a very subtle waxiness as well but it's mostly the powdery quality of the Irish that I get in the dry down even though the Irish is the center stage of the other in the dry down it's the other elements that you get previously in the scent which also stick around which helps to round out and gives it more of a character than a standalone iris scent i pick up in the dry down the iris like i've said but you also get the, the aftershave liquid sort of feel in the opening the ginger the cinnamon the clove and the jasmine especially works really well with the iris in terms of performance on my skin this lasted around six hours uh, projection was good for the first three hours but after which it started to sit quite closely to my skin it didn't project too strongly uh, but the style of fragrance that this is I think that's okay uh, but I was a little bit disappointed if it projected a little bit more I would have enjoyed this other a little bit more uh, in terms of scent I thought it was beautiful it's uh, one of the best iris scents I've tried not the best iris other though the best iris other for me so far is, has to be iris soir by sultan pasha but this one was definitely high up there uh, wearing this it sort of gives off a very elegant feel it's it feels like a gentlemanly however i would picture this be, uh, this other being perfect for a woman especially when she's wearing a white dress it's, it just conjures up that image for me it's an Irish Sheepra that sort of reminds me of old school fragrances. Uh, it's sort of reminded me of Spirit of a Hellenic Republic, also by Alexa Utter as well. It has this old school feel, old school French perfumery in that Utter form, which I think is outstanding. Uh, I mentioned it in my review of Spirit of a Hellenic Republic as well by Alexa Utter that I imagine Utter as being quite uh, Oriental, Eastern sort of sense that combines spices, ouds, uh, patchouli, these sort of uh, scents but this other it's just through and through very French like in its way and it's this is an other which would really suit a western nose. 
Uh, in terms of my final overall rating, it's going to get high score, 4.5 out of 5. Uh, this one is going to be perfect for a woman that's going to be wearing this to like a formal event. But I could also see myself wearing this as well when I'm wearing a white shirt to a formal event. It's got a very elegant and a very gentlemanly uh, uh, feel about it. So 4.5 out of 5. That's Ari Shipra from the House of Elixir Akbar. Guys, if you've enjoyed this review, please do leave me a like and a comment below. And if you haven't subscribed to the channel, make sure you do. Until next time, my friends, see you later.